What's up, everybody? We are almost there. Chris, Sports Talk Detroit, it's almost draft time. And in this video, we're doing a little NFL draft Detroit Lions primer. So mm. what we're going to be doing, we're going to share quickly what we're most looking forward to in this NFL draft when we're watching it Thursday, Friday, Saturday, maybe what day we're most looking forward to. But we also want this to be the most heavily commented on video we've ever had here at Sports Talk Detroit. So let us know in the comments, what are you looking forward to most? You could even, if you want to be negative, Nancy, tell us what you're least looking forward to. But we want to know what you're looking forward to. What's your favorite part of draft day and with the Lions? So, Chris, I'm going to go ahead and have you give me, give me what's one of your, maybe, maybe it's for the Lions specifically, maybe not. What's one of the things you look forward to? Maybe it's every year, maybe it's this year. I'm going to let you take it away. Yeah, I, I love the transparency in, uh, in this new regime, and you yes. see it with some of the videos they do. So that is something I'll really look forward to is like after the draft when they put together – the whole thing, For but sure. even just seeing like the war room, um, our war room again with Patricia, you got a couple glimpses, but you never really felt like you were in there, but mm -hmm. this is like, they, they really allowed the cameras in, you don't know how it all works, but basically what I love is just seeing like Brad Holmes, Dan Campbell. They look like, it just looks like everybody gets along. It just feels like they're on the same page. You got Chris Spielman in there. You get, you know, you got some different guys in there. Dorsey. I don't know if he's even still around, but you still, you see all these dudes that it's like, Awesome, man. So I just I'm excited to see them as they prep and kind of celebrate. Probably not like they did for Panay, but just just seeing that everybody together in the war room is something that I'm looking forward to. Yeah, I think um, I'll hit one here and I'll go off of the Brad Holmes war room, all the excitement, stuff like that. I'm feeling so much more calm, even though I kind of hate the position we're in at number two. I think this is the worst draft to be number two. I'd rather be five or six. I know that sounds weird, but I almost would. And I, I think like, I don't love the position we're in, but I love the people we have making the decisions. So yeah. I'm just looking forward to just relaxing kind of, it will do it right here. We'll just kind of sit back, enjoy watching the draft being like, I don't think they're going to royally screw this up. And uh, so yeah. we could just in just enjoy ourselves and and have fun watching the draft. And I'm actually really excited just to watch it as a whole and looking for trades and things like that. Just seeing who's going to drop, who's going to rise. Like, I, I know I gave you a bunch of stuff there, but man, it's just it's yeah. draft time. It's a season filled with hope. Yeah, that's right. For us, it's hope. And that's that's all we need. And another thing I'm really looking forward to is is just the overall um atmosphere and that be that you know the first 15 minutes when they're gonna do some drone shot of you know everybody and it's just like you know people just love football man yes. and, and it is it's such a and i get it and i we we know why it's like you got these college college teams that are just you're so invested in there's players mm -hmm. off of there in the league and then they go up and they have to be there for three years just to let your body develop the whole thing right in the nba mm -hmm. you jump around you don't know half the guys and and really only like 10 guys really make it in the in the True. nba but NFL, True. it's like, dude. And so one, one more I'm really excited for deep. is you can go deep in that draft and it yeah, matters. You can go deep, and that's what I'm really looking forward to. To your point earlier, I, I really do trust Brad Holmes. And so when we pick somebody up, even if it's somebody we didn't expect, I I'm really looking forward to diving into that person. And, and I'm guarantee you will yes. be like, okay, this was good. Just like St. Brown, you know, he's kind of the crown jewel of uh, Brad Holmes so far. Hopefully, it's like, who's that next St. Brown that we're like, yeah. oh, okay, this is, I like that. Good job, Brad. Yeah, good job, Brad. And like, if we get two bona fide, no problem starters off every draft or three, like we did with the last one, like, great, let's go. Let's Boom. just keep doing it. And, and I think like, I do look forward to that. I love it. And I'm going to, I'm going to get cheesy here for a second. One of the things I'm really looking forward to is just spending Thursday with this community that's watching this right now mm -hmm. people that have been commenting um positive negative everywhere in between like this is a community usually on draft night it's me maybe me and a couple buddies you know and i'm just i'm watching it and it's like fine but this year if as we go live on thursday we're actually watching it with detroit lions nation sports talk detroit nation together and i think mm -hmm. i'm just really excited to have that feel going on and we can get immediate reaction. People love it, hate it anywhere in between. 
and we can kind of see that pulse on what Lions fans are feeling this year and their confidence level going forward. Yeah, because we've never obviously we've never done it before. So it's no. like, man, this will be so so cool to to see because I think we all the nice thing is, and I think we're gonna do it, is we do have like a certain kind of path that we want to take in this draft, like yeah. defense and oh, we okay, we do we did get a splash receiver. Okay, we're we're cool with that. And so I think we're going to do the right things, like we keep yep. saying. So it's going to be exciting and fun. I, I doubt we'll have one of those just devastating, you know, take a tackle at two. Moments. Jelani Tavai in the second round. Yeah, I just don't think we're going to have that. And, and we're not right where you just don't even know. It's like I never even heard of this guy until this and moment right here. Jordan just, dies on in a previous. Video. Yeah. Yeah. So give me just. <laughs> who we kind of expect, which I think we will. And it'll be just, it's going to be fun. And I just, it will. Oh, yeah, I'm and with you a more ton and more of depth in this draft. I mean, like through pick hundred, 125, there is so much depth. So I'm really looking forward to rounds two, three, four. I, man, this is going to be fun. So I'm excited. I'm excited to do this with everybody um, in the community Hit those comments, hit them hard. Let us know what you're most excited for in this draft. And we will see you, hopefully, all of you live on the 28th, 8 o'clock p.m. for the draft. Chris, you got any final parting ways? Nope. I will. We'll see you all then. Go live. All right. See ya. See ya.